just gonna give it a second here. So where am I at? Okay. Hmm. Oh, there I am. Okay. All right. So I know usually I give a notice, but this is, I know, a very, very short notice. <laughs> um, if you are just joining me, again, you're just catching the replay. If you don't see that live button on this side of the screen. Uh, so don't forget to hit hashtag replay. And if you are coming in, uh, say hi. Say hello so I can say hi back to you. And uh, yeah, so let's get started. I figured I'll just come in here for about an hour and just, you know, share with you what I am working on. Um, I figured, you know, why not? <laughs> so if you are coming in, uh, please say hi so I can say hi and let me know if you can hear me just fine. Uh, oh, hello, my, my, Margarita. Okay, this one is not giving me. Let me see if I can open this and be able to read. Oh, let's see here. Come on. You just bear with me for a minute. And yeah, here we go. Hi, Gil. Let me see. Hello, Veronica. Thank you for being here, ladies. Uh, don't forget to share me out. And yeah, so I, like I said, I know that <laughs> this is a really short notice. So I just like... I have nothing to do so i'm like let me get in here and do something so i wanted to share with you now i'm sure most of you already know how to do this but i just figured you know come in here and share something with someone that maybe perhaps uh merry christmas Jill. uh perhaps they never done and which is uh valentine's cookies and and if i have enough time alicia hello hello peggy i wanted to also show you what i am working on and um well two projects that i'm working on so hi tammy how are you okay so i am going to i i found this um cookies when i went shopping i think it was at marshall's and they had like all of these heart shaped not heart shaped but valentine cookies cutters and i love this one so i wanted to do this one which is the an envelope um Oh, hello, Mel. Nice to see you here. Thank you for stopping by. <laughs> Thank you for being here. Uh, and like I said, I want to try this one out. So it has also, it came with a flower, heart shapes, a bowl, uh, lips, stick and tongue, and then a peace sign in shape of a heart. So I wanted to try this out, um, this one. So this is what I'm going to be doing. And then also I'm going to show you what I've been working on. I'm working on that wash through. Okay, no worries. Thank you for being here. I hope you have a good day at work. Uh, I just got home myself from work. So I was like, you know what? I, I, I've been thinking about all this. Like, you know, let me get in there. Okay, ladies. So um, it's just going to be a little bit loud. So I am just mixing up some white and brown clay because I want the bottom of my cookies to be uh light not dark because i thought that the other that i have did well i don't know if you guys can see this one this is like a little bit too dark and i don't want that to be that dark so you can see there the difference so i want it to look almost like a little bit lighter almost like raw <laughs> cookie <laughs> if that makes any sense <laughs> so how's everyone's thanks uh thanksgiving christmas <laughs> i hope everybody had a good and wonderful Christmas time with your family. Um, I need to clean my table. Wait, I think it's later on here. Okay. And again, I know I did not let no one know that I was coming in here because I myself did not know. Um, and I just figured, you know, I have nothing better to do. So let me just get in here and do this plus plus i'm not sure also um but i'm thinking about taking off i can't see anything without my glasses <laughs> oh, okay I, same i have to have my my glasses on. and it's more like readers so it's not that i can't see 
Well, I don't know. I don't know. I, I think I'm going, I'm getting older. That's the, that's just the truth. I'm getting older. <laughs> it's hard to see. Um, but really, it's for reading, and it's, uh, and I think I got used to them. But anyway, like I was saying, uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to come on here next week at all, because I really want to take some time off. Uh, also, you know, it's, uh, it'll be after New Year's, and I would have to put all of that Christmas stuff away. And that's because I chose not to do all of the stuff. You know, I just brought half of my Christmas stuff out. I was like, I'm not going to spend two weekends in, in uh, decorating the house and then just to take it off. It's fun when you're putting it up because you're listening to Christmas music, you know, uh, watching Christmas movies, you know, because you can't wait for Christmas. But then when it's once it's all over, <laughs> forget about it. It's like, ugh, dreading calling anyone. Hey, you want to come help? No. <laughs> so, I'm like, okay. So, yeah, that and also, uh, you know, starting the new year. Or actually, I don't know if y'all guys do this or not, but before the New Year's Eve, um, before New Year's Day, I like to clean my house completely clean. Um, like to take all things that I'm like the old stuff out there's no good you know hello Connie I don't take mine off until pink oh the other Loreas when is that that's it's the six right I think is it the six yeah um I don't know I just start feeling like too overwhelmed when I see too many things so sometimes even in here I try not to look at my stuff when they're all scattered it was really yeah day, yeah day six um so it's uh just i don't know i like to do that i like to have, have a clean sweep i guess you can say um when it comes to new year's that and what other tradition um i like to uh see what else I don't know if y'all guys have any traditions or any superstitions or stuff like that. I know I am. Uh, I have my grapes. I gotta have my grapes, you know. And then I also write like a little message uh, for this next year to come, you know, what I want uh, to accomplish and all of that. And then I burn it. Um, so those are my wishes. And also another thing that I like to do. Um, let's see what what am i forgetting let's see i have my grapes clean my house completely clean uh burn oh yes burn uh write my message you know that what i want my new year to bring me and then um this might be a little too far i don't know if you ever heard about this uh but i like to grab like coins and i'll put it inside a little plastic bag and i'll tie it up and then i'll put it inside water and then i'll put that next to the sink and that's supposed to uh supposedly you're supposed to bring money in you know you're always supposed to have money into your home so i know it's a little bit superstitious but it's just something that uh someone told me many years ago and i've been doing it every single year and it's actually every single day so if, whenever i see that the water starts going low i just go and <laughs> pour it in there you know fill it back up to the rim of the of the bowl or the little glass that i have it in you do the same oh you do the same on taking down the stuff okay i don't know do y'all have any any routines or i don't know what they are, are uh what would you call it um oh hi helen how are you uh yeah so i just like to just stuff like that i like to do you know for new year's eve um before new year's eve and i think i think oh and then i don't know if y'all guys do this or not but <laughs> so like they say that if you wear red underwear you're supposed to have like true love <laughs> i have not tried that one out <laughs> um i don't know why i'm whispering that <laughs> anyway so hi carl um so is it carol carol um my apologies and yeah so there's like a, lo a lot of stuff that i know there's other stuff out there um 
But I think those are the main ones that I make sure that I don't, you know, don't forget to do. And I'm at, at work, I'm telling everybody, make sure you have your grapes. Make sure you have your grapes. <laughs> You're supposed to have like 12 grapes, I think. And I think like each grape is supposed to identify like the month or something like that. Um, well, like I said, this is at least what they told. I don't know if there's anything else. I think that's it. I think that's it. And all right. Um, I like to brush oil on my clay. So this... I don't know if you can see that or not. Can you guys see the table good? Should I lower that? Lower? Is it me or is the camera looks like it's cricket? What? It does, doesn't it? Look like it's cricket or something. It looks real good. Let me lower that down. There you go. I think that's better. Okay. All right. So let me do this again because I really don't like how this came out. All right, let me uh, brush some oil on my... Hello, Donna. Let me brush some oil on my cookie cutter. I want it to be smoother. Oh, and then um, this is the only one that I'm sad about. <laughs> they said that the first person you kiss on New Year's Eve is the, supposed to be the one you'll be kissing on the last year of Christmas, which I don't, I mean, of the next year. I don't know if that's true. I don't think so. Hello, Car Carolina. Carolina. Kathleen. Kathleen. yeah so i don't know what do you do you guys got any traditions so what are your plans for new year's are you staying home i am i don't want to be out there i'm too old to be out there <laughs> partying i like no sleep time nine o'clock that's it i have to work the next day so all right this is a little bit better Okay, so I want to do one more. New Year's is a big deal. I don't have. To. Oh, it is. Okay. Uh, for us, it's, it's usually um Christmas Eve. You know, that's when we start celebrating. But uh, this year, my sister had to go went to Mexico on vacation, and which she usually does. But for whatever reason, she decided to do it on Christmas Day this week. And she won't be back until after New Year's. So uh, her kids came over and spent it with me. So it was a little weird, you know, not having her um, here with us. But we survived. <laughs> yeah, New Year's, um, not really. It's like... Kids are all telling me, sorry, Tia, we're not going to be able to come over. I'm like, trust me, I'm okay with that. I am okay with that. I I, I, I can't, especially if you if you have to go to work the next day, which in this case I do. Um, I'm fine. I don't need to stay up late. I know I'm going to, even though I don't want to, because in my neighborhood, you know, uh, they're going to, every year, I've noticed that, well, then I'm sure that's everywhere fireworks you know and then people don't people go out there with their guns and you can hear the difference between a firework and then people shooting their guns um i don't know but i know that's going to keep me up and that's going to last for a couple of days because on let's see christmas eve i was already hearing fireworks going up up he has to work oh so you're going to be home by yourself oh hell so sorry you want to come over <laughs> Yeah, so, <clears throat> but, um, let's see here, I don't, yeah, I think I'm going to, well, I have to go to work, come home, uh, I think I'll probably do a video, you know, record a video, and then off to bed I go, watch a movie, 
take a little bit more stuff out too. Yep. Right? Uh, I like to... Uh, I, I don't know how much deep cleaning you do, Veronica, but I, I do it all. I'm throwing out dishes that I know I'm not going to use. Or uh, whatever, you know, clothes. Oh, I really don't throw it. I, I give it away at Goodwill. Um, clean my car. Make sure that my lawn is mowed. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I clean everything. I was like, so that's why I I want to. I think I'm gonna start this. Um, what's today? Tuesday? No, today's Tuesday. Oh my God, today's Tuesday. I need to hurry up. <laughs> um, I would say yeah. I guess I'm, after I finish this video, I'm gonna I'm gonna have to start start cleaning. All right, Raymond. I'm gonna have to start cleaning and. And get ready for the New Year's because I don't want my house to start a new year with my dirty house. Uh -uh. Yeah. Okay, so that's, we'll do that color. And then I want to do, um, I think I'll do, um, let me see. Oh, you know what? No, I don't. Let me just, I guess I'll do light green. After this. Sharon, I'm... Oh, well, welcome, Sharon. Happy to have you here. And um, I don't know if you're just joining us or not, but we're talking about the New Year's and how you celebrate New Year's. If you celebrate, what are your traditions? Um, do you, Are you superstitious like myself? <laughs> you know, Hispanic and Catholic at that. <laughs> so you can just imagine. <laughs> Oh, thank you, Kathleen, for welcoming Shannon. Sharon, sorry, Sharon. <laughs> oh, thank you, Raymond. That's sweet of you. Yeah, I came in here uh, just to do some uh, cookies for Valentine's, and then if I have enough time, I want to share with you what I am working on. Um, so I'm kind of excited because I I started working on it uh, about two weeks ago and then I just stopped. I'm like, anymore, I'm going to finish it and I'm not going to be able to share with no one how I did it. <laughs> so I don't want to do that and today. I want to... Hola, Carly. So let's see here. Um, let me get this out the way. You know what? Yeah. And then just do this. Oh, hello, Iris. Working out details for my first Mardi Gras. Oh, you know what? That's something I don't think I've ever done anything that is Mardi Gras. No, I don't think so. But I can't wait to see what you're going to do, Raymond. And I love your vintage Santas. Oh, I was like, oh my gosh, look at that. I could watch that that video all day. <laughs> it's like I love it. I have a small little collection. Mine is nothing like what you have, you know. Especially the little teeny tiny uh, cups. I love those. Oh, so that's what you're gonna be using. You're gonna be using clay. Well, I can't wait to see what you're going to come up with. Your tree, love that idea that you, what you were using, um, the, what do you call that? Uh, the caulking? Good idea. Great idea. Ah, this is, okay. The, I did not brush any oil on that. So okay yes okay guys I am being very um, 
careful with what I have, you know, with what I'm saying today, because um, I think my daughter-in-law must have watched the previous video. Because for Christmas, she gave me a bracelet that has a cross on it. <laughs> if you guys watched my video, you know what I'm talking about, my previous video. <laughs> I am making Valentine cookies. Um, when she gave me the bracelet, I was like, oh, please tell me you didn't see that video. <laughs> yeah, I was like, oh my God, I was, I was just waiting for her to say something. And I was like, oh, that's pretty. And the first thing popped in my head, I'm like, oh my gosh, please tell me you didn't watch that video. <laughs> please don't. Please also don't, didn't, I hope she didn't share that with, if she did, I hope she did not show her mother. Yeah, don't get me wrong. You know, she's she's uh, not her mom. She's a lovely lady. Just, there's something about when another woman says, oh, that's my son. <laughs> like, I love that she loves my son, but there's a limit. <laughs> you know, like, <laughs> hold on, lady. Last time I remembered, I popped that baby up. <laughs> not you. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, not as well as of yet. I have not. <laughs> I hope not. <laughs> I'm just. I'm still waiting that, you know. If Big Brother wants to come and say something to me, but as of right now, no, I'm. I'm still good. I. You know what? I did notice that. Um, the day after my page was like freezing, uh, there was like a lot of messages that I wasn't getting or replies and stuff like that. I'm like, what the heck. But as of right now, um, I'm good. <laughs> Fingers crossed. Okay, so for this one, because it is a envelope, I need to do... It shows that there's like a letter. So I want to do that. So I'm going to grab some white. Um, and of course I didn't grab the white. I don't have one. All right. So... We kept some white clay here, and I look like I'm gonna have to order more clay. And I still have not figured out how to take off the subtitles. If anyone has the uh, same type of camera that I do, which is um, Bimu, Bimu, Bimu. Yes, Raymond. Yes, I, I I heard the music just a little bit, and I was like, uh oh, like I hope he's not, you know. And next thing I know, you were freezing. I'm like, wait, but then you were continue. Then it would freeze again. I'm like, uh oh. I was like, oh my gosh. But it was good that you were able to like log off and then log back in. Yeah, I, that was crazy because I the very first time that I did my video was here. Um, of course I was recording. I wasn't like live or anything like that. And I didn't realize that I was that I had also music, Christmas music in the background, really, really soft. And it was actually from my TV. It was really low, and I, I got in trouble. <laughs> I was like, they shut it down. I was like, oh, are you kidding me? But that was like maybe two years ago. And it wasn't on this page. It was on my other page, um, private page. So I'll use this one. This is crazy. And you know how I was talking, uh, mentioned that about how a lot of my pictures and previous videos that had music were all taken down. Um, I noticed that, like, I think Remy, you had one up too that you play music, and I'm like, okay, what's going on? Why is mine down and everybody can play music? So I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna try one more time. So I went ahead and um, I'm just going to cut a square little piece because it's going to be for the letter that's going to go in there. And um, I'm like, I'm going to see what happens. So I used this time the music that it's there. I did not grab the music that um, YouTube or any one of uh, these other...
wow uh, it, it is getting crazy in the meantime you see other videos that they're saying bad words and they're still up you know <laughs> okay i i don't i don't get it um but yeah so i just went ahead and used the music and i'm gonna see what happens and see what they say you know what i'm not gonna use it i just want to cut this and try to see if i can make it put it underneath there all right so i'm gonna want to place a, a letter writing a letter right there so but before i do that you know what needs to be small so i think i'm gonna place it this way okay I'm gonna, i don't want my fan is running so i don't want the clay to get dry Yeah, in the beginning, I got that same thing that it was mute in other countries. I'm like, okay, I don't care. No, just don't do it here. Um, but that was it. And that was the very first video. From there, I have not gotten anything like that. And I'm like, the heck? Is it certain videos that you don't like? <laughs> like, I don't uh, But see, when, when I'm on YouTube, it tells me if I want to share this with Face. And I'm like, okay and hola maricela and um so i do it i'm like they're the ones telling me if, if i want to but if they don't want me to use the music over there they should say before uploading you know a uh, warning your video will be shut down if you share or something the music but nothing so i don't know it's a bit confusing at times it's like i don't even know if it's worth it so that's why I started loading all these videos or pictures without music. I'm like, okay, let's see what happens now. Okay, let me cut this. I think this is looks a little bit too wide. Let me do this one more time. Okay, so what, um, you know when you open the envelope and it's like, you know how it's like there's a B and you open the envelope? Not, um, but that's what I'm going to try to do here. I wonder, um, this is probably too green. If I want to do greener on this, what do you think? If I add the pink to this and then do the green on that, or should I... Just stick with the green, I mean the pink on each, you know, and then the green on this one. Because if I add the pink here, I feel like it's just going to blend and I don't think you'll, I mean, well, then again, it is thick, so you're definitely going to be able to see it. So what do y'all think? Should I just go ahead and do the pink on pink? Or should I add the green on the pink? Like before I touch that, let me see. I don't know. I feel like mix it up. Yeah, let's let's see how that works. Okay, so now I want to do the V shape. Where's my small scissors? Alright, so what I'm going to do, I'm just going to curve this, and then I'm going to snip. Let's see here. Okay, so that's there. You know what I think? Of? A little bit too, too long. So right where they connect, I'm not, I don't care too much if it's one is bigger than the other because I am going to add the white part that is going to be the letter. 
Okay, so let me see. All right, so I'm going to go halfway like this, just like that. Okay. Now I want my the white to dry because I want to write on it. Um, but so for in the meantime, well, that is since I have the fan running, I'm hoping that that dries it up. Uh, fast enough let me press this down because I don't want them to raise I am going to add a flower to it uh, all right so this is too dark um, Oh my god, what's the name of this flower? Uh, I think it's called Blossom. Uh, I think, I don't know if you guys... <laughs> so I think it's, it's a blossom. It's like a sherry blossom. I think that's just what it's called, a sherry blossom. So, now, because, again, I don't want the clay to stick in there. I'm just going to go right ahead and just add my oil in there. Alright. And then I'm going to... Let's see here. I think that's probably too much clay. Okay, and that should pop out real quick and easy instead of struggling with it. Oh, thank you, Margarita. All right, so let's add some greenery, leaves. That in there okay and then the other little one now this thing is so small I think I think I got this from Timo if that's correct I think that's where it came from um, now the only thing I don't like about it, I mean, I love it, but the only thing is because, do you see how thin, I don't know if you guys can see where the stick is at, you see that? It's, well, that is not a challenge for me because I'm going to roll this out as thin as possibly can, and then I'm just going to spread this open, stick that in there, and that did not sound right, but <laughs> we're all grown ups here. Okay, so we're just going to place the clay in there. Okay, all right, so there we are. Now I'm just going to go ahead and take them all out. Which, it was the first one. Let's see. This the leaf, and then the baby leaf. And then, this. come on, get out. Now this, I have to be very careful because I don't want it to rip on me since it's so thin. There we go. Okay, excellent. All right, so now I'm going to just place the flower there. And then I want this to go here like that. I'll show you guys in a minute. Let me just... Okay, so... I guess because it's green on green, the leaf is somewhat invisible. I mean, you can be able to still, still be able to see it. It's just it like it blends too much in. It. So I think on the pink one, you're gonna be able to see it a lot better. So there it is. Let me see if I can lower this there. Nope. <laughs> Let me see now. I don't know if you guys can see that or not, but I love the flower because you can really see the detail and I don't know if you guys can tell or not um, well you know what I I forgot I can zoom in nope wrong way <laughs> sorry guys <laughs> right there can y'all see that so I love that and then of course like I said I don't have to worry about 
um, where the clay meets because it's going to be covering that up. So I think on this one, we're going to be able to see it. So it's going to pop out more because the colors are, the pink is, is hot pink. Oh no, this is, is it bubblegum pink? It's some kind of pink, I don't remember right now, but yeah. All right, this is still not dry, so I'm going to let it continue getting dry because if I want to use a ink pen, um, I don't want it to bleed, so I have to make sure that it's completely dry. All right, so let's see here. I guess we're going to do the green on this one. And then, um, oh, thank you. Thank you. Happy you guys like it. I wish I could give you a stars, but the camera I'm using is not going to let me do it. I will give you a, not stars, hearts right back at you. <laughs> okay, so let me do this one. Press that down. And then once it completely dries, I am going to go in with um, my adhesive spray. It just has some little black spot. Um, and it'll give it like that really pretty shine on the flower. Well, the whole thing. What am I doing? Oh. All right. Okay. Cover that. No, actually, I want you to dry it. All right. So here we go with the pink one. And. All right, so I don't want it to be too wide. I think that should be good enough. Let me just hide this underneath there. All right, so here. Let me see if I can. You know what? I can actually do that. It doesn't necessarily have to be. Oh, thank you, Connie, for sprinkling. Thank you. Yes, get me out there. You know, this would help my page grow. All right, I think the, the not the V, but I think like, almost, well, it kind of does look like a V. Uh, I think this way it will be easier and better this way. I don't have to worry about it if it's, if there's a gap or if it's going to show. Yeah, I'll show you what I mean. Just curve that instead, instead of cutting it and then trying to make sure that it lines up right. Okay. And then I guess once it's completely, also before I add the adhesive spray, I can add glitter to it. I think that will look really pretty. So now I'm just going to, after it dries up, try to figure out like what I want to write on it. Like what cute little, thank you Kathleen, uh, what cute little message I want to write on there. All right. So the same thing here. With this one, where did I leave it? Oh, there we go. Um, press that down on there. And, yeah, I think there's no more oil in there. I'm not going to take a chance. I'm going to crush this again. So I know a lot of people, they use sprays and um, for their molds or their cookie cutters i love to use baby oil it's, i think it's a little bit cleaner i don't have to worry about the spray going everywhere just when i have to clean this table <laughs> it's bad <laughs> really really bad bad because of all the glitter And then the spray, um, actually I have it right here. I use my Podge. So that's the spray that I use on my pieces. This is too much clay. Okay, so there's that. Let's do the flower. Not too much clay. Okay. Yeah. Still too much. Press that in there. Okay, and then some more. 
All right. There we go. Oh, you know what? Almost forgot my letter. This is too big. Just cut that down a little bit. Okay, and then this one. I don't want it to cover the heart. Mm, oh, great. Oh, well, it got stuck. <laughs> That's okay. That should be good enough. Okay, and then my flower. Now we'll add the stem. And then we'll add, I think to the big, mm, this one, because it's bigger, we'll again put it down here so will be falling over and then touching the pink so it won't be too blended and into the green part of the envelope and then this little bitty one right here that's going to cover there where the letter set all right so i think this one it's cuter because this one pops out i don't know if you guys can see that okay so there you go this is how easy this cookie was to make let me show you how they look after they dry up i wrote on because i previously made some um just different colors all right so now i used a 0 0.4 pen uh this is how this one and i wrote love on that oh thank you kathleen thank you so and then I went ahead and sprayed it down. I don't know if you can see that. I don't know if you can see the shine in it. Oh, no, not this one. This one hasn't been sprayed down. This is the one that I sprayed down. And the only thing I sprayed was the flower. Um, but of course, because I have to wait for that to dry up. And then I'm going to go in there and spray that. And then this is the other one. I tried to use red on there. I don't know if you can see that or not. It's, but then I went in with the black and I wrote um, on top of the red. You know, so... If you decide to write um, and use an ink pen, this is like the really tip is really like really thin. Make sure that your piece is completely dry because otherwise it will uh, bleed. And then your pretty project will be all messed up. All right. Um, so now that I got those done, I am going to, uh, let's move these out the way. Oh, I can't see this spray, but this is a dog. Oh, um, you can't see that? Let me see. You can see it from here. See, so I think it's, if you can't, I don't know if you can see the shine or not. Let me see if I can zoom in again. All right, guys, bear with me for a minute. Mm, I think it's the light above that it's making it hard to see. Now, but anyways, okay, so yeah, just, I let the, <laughs> um, okay, so yeah, just let your project and then spray it if you want to or not. I like to spray because I feel like it helps to prevent them from cracking or spreading the clay and what have you. My piece is what I've noticed. All right, bad stuff. Okay, so you guys remember when I did the heart? No, this one right here. With the uh, hearts all around, roses on the top. You know, I share with you how to do roses and then these little roses as well. I just did these. Uh, these are smaller roses I did by hand and added the glitter. Now, these little hearts, they have like little faces and I thought that was so adorable what type of pen do you use this is a um cricket pen Does anyone get
Ờ. Lux series of the cotton. Are you talking are you talking about the subtitles? If it's the subtitles, I don't know how to take that off. I'm trying my hard. It's, I'm using a Mevo camera and I went into the settings and I can't seem to figure out where exactly it's it's at, where I can uh, turn that off. I do apologize for that. There's nothing I can do about that. Um, but if you know, or anybody out there knows, tell me, <laughs> please share with me. Yes, and then I'm also, re I, I can see it on my laptop, but on my iPad, was where the controls are at. I don't see anything there. And it's driving me insane. Okay. <laughs> All right. So I use a Cricut pen and, um, and again, it's a 0 0.4 and it's just a black pen. Uh, but you can use any pen. I just like this one because the tip is really, um, as you can see really small there. And I have always used this when it comes to writing on my fig pigs. Okay. Well, that's weird. Oh, okay. All right. So this is what I want to do, but not exactly. Well, you saw how I wrapped that with the pink. So here's again. And this time I want to do it a little different, but not adding hearts. And also I have a mold that I, you know, I don't know where it's at now. Oh, the <laughs> Okay, so here's this one. And I think this came from Amazon. And so I wanted to do something like add um, clay and then wrap this around because I really love this and um, I don't know I want to do pink underneath and I wanted to do like a tree as well and I don't know if I should just like do that around should I add roses or um, I have another mold where is it at this one and it's a rose but this right here this mold is flat and here I made quite a few of them so maybe if I can just like probably add some of those I don't know we'll see but I want to do that and then I have something else I want to share with you so first I'm going to cover this and I think maybe I should do the light pink yeah do I have an open one I do not All right, so I think I finished it no, yeah. okay I still have some left No, I'm going to Google, um, sorry about the noise. Let me grab this up. Okay, I'm going to Google to see how I can take the subtitles off because it is annoying. <laughs> I do agree with you, it's like, oh. If, but I don't understand why some of you can see it and others can't. Square with the two C series somewhere. No, see, that's just it. There's no little square. Last time I was messing with this, I was, I think I shut it off. Um, but I can tell you what it has. It has, um, what does it have? It has two arrows. So I guess if I can go to the next video, um, so I mean, next camera, and then where I can adjust the frame. And then it has a, like a bunch of little boxes, which is like six boxes, and then three dots. So I don't. Let me see. I think I'm just click it on it. Turn off or on captions. The right hand side. 
no i don't i don't see it on the bottom right corner click on the three dots okay pop up screen and use the button turn off caption okay so pop up came out now what i'm showing is an i with the letter a and then there's like supposed to be the microphone and then three little circles and then i guess it's supposed to be like the play button question mark um and then i guess i don't know it's supposed to be a box and then like but with an arrow sticking out and then there's supposed to be the settings and then the an x it would be the viewers that can turn it off individually the box is white and smooth oh yeah there's there's nothing here if i go into settings this is i'm afraid that this is going to like completely take me out and i won't know how to get back in there because i did that before and i was like i was panicking i was like oh my gosh what the heck but what i'm going to do once i go off i'm going to go in there and i'm going to see um if i don't find the caption where i can turn it off then i'll just google it but it doesn't show it here because I, I know Sue has one and I asked her and she said she didn't know also. Uh, Maricela, do you have one of these uh, cameras? Okay, I think that's good. To the side. Oh, okay. I thought you did. <laughs> I was like, okay. <laughs> this viewer turns it off. Okay, so the viewer has to turn it off. Well, I wish I could turn it off on my end. Which, if you guys can see that, Shelby does. Okay. Um, yeah, I need to ask someone. Well, first I'm going to see if I can Google it. If I can't find it, then I'm just going to see if anyone who has one can probably help me out and <laughs> tell me how to shut that off because I don't know. Hi, Brandy. How are you? Thank you for being here with me. Okay. And I'm... Well, I went into the settings that I can remember, and it showed there, um, like if I wanted to adjust the picture, um, the volume. I have no time to shut them off. Um, um, but I don't don't remember. Else. Um, I don't. You know what? I don't even know. I should read the manual. It should be probably in there. Okay, so I think this is good enough to go all the way around my oh yeah oh, it's... yes that is correct that is also a good reason to have it on there uh, but if it's the viewers who can shut it off um, you know then that'll be great too so wait uh I just wish I knew how to turn it off. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Margarita. That's nice of you. All right, so I'm just going to go ahead and trim this part off. off as well okay so while i am doing this i need your help this is going to be the bottom the base where i'm going to set my tree on and i cannot i would not know what to put on here i'm trying to figure it out and i just don't know um i went ahead and cover at the bottom and i don't know if i should just add the pink just a little, or what do y'all think I should add on top of here to cover this? 
So I have, maybe I should add some green to make it look like your skin is very small on my end anyway. Could be white. It could be white or something. My screen, like this, this screen right here, because this right here, I can. This is as wide as as it get. Um. Oh. This is a a new camera. So I know if you're using a phone and if you have it a certain angle, then your screen it's smaller. But I'm not using a phone, I'm using an actual camera. Uh, so I'm able to make my screen small or big, which is what I have been wanting to do because I do, when I make my videos, a lot of people say, hey, you know, we can't see, can you zoom in or this and that. Uh, so I just went ahead and, and purchased this. So is that, and plus I'm trying to keep this, I don't want you guys to look at my mess. <laughs> terrible back there <laughs> no but you know what i'm gonna leave like that if if y'all guys see something that is not in this place keep it to yourself <laughs> yes you know when i first uh when i first got it i was telling my son i'm like what's wrong with the picture <laughs> you know and we were like messing with it and i was like i don't know it's like i don't like it <laughs> but now uh, I'm like, you know what? I love it. Yeah, it's nice. <laughs> no, but um, it's not that bad back there. Just some stuff that I haven't had a chance to pick up. <laughs> Just, I don't know. I feel like if things are not in its place, you know, um, it's, it's just me, you know. I feel like it's something not right. <laughs> it's just colorful. Oh, thank you. It matches you. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, oh, thank you, Brandy. My, I, I can hear my mom in the background, you know, like, Maria, everything has its place. So, I'm like, okay, mom. <laughs> don't see it. You, you don't, yeah, because I'm hiding it. <laughs> I did a video a couple of months ago. Was is it a couple of months ago? Um, about, you know, my whole room, how it was just a mess. And because I did like organization and all of that, how to organize stuff. And I couldn't believe it. I got a lot of people saying, oh, it's not that bad. You should see mine. I'm like, <laughs> I'm like, this is bad for me. This is really, really bad. And my sister told me, it's like, very brave woman <laughs> to go in there and show your craft room. I'm like, I know. What was I thinking? <laughs> like, I, I don't even want them to see down here. You don't want to see down here. <laughs> it's like I have stuff, stuff underneath the table. I mean, they're, they're in baskets, but still, I feel like I don't have enough room. I think I might just have to move into my master bedroom and make this my bedroom. Oh. Mm. Well, thank you. Yeah. Out of the whole thing that I did in this room, my favorite... It's the where I keep my sprinkles. Top favorite. Um, th those containers that I got from the Dollar Tree. That is my top favorite. Have I gotten around to do all of my sprinkles? No, I have not. <laughs> now it's just a matter of time. <laughs> you know, but I think that when I take um, the week off from doing videos and crafting and everything, I think that's when I'm going to do that. Don't, I don't want to see yours. <laughs> Uh, uh, cleaning your, your room, Maricela? <laughs> okay, so I think this is good enough. All right, so this is very soft. Once I lay this on top of that, that's it. I'm not going to be able to remove it. That's why I don't care about using glue. Um, so, all right, here goes nothing. Now, try to, I have to make more, but I wanted to show you, share with you what I was what I've been doing. Uh, I made a bigger one because obviously that also came with a big one. But I think this is a little bit too big. Uh, let me see how it looks against that. I think, yeah, it's way too big for this. Um, yeah, even if it's down here, it's way too big. So do you see this part right here? I Not to worry about that because once it dries up, that will disappear. As long as it's not too deep in there, then I don't have to worry about it. 
Um, plus, if you're going to, you know, I'll probably even cover it up so you won't be able to see it. All right, so I think, um, let me see here. How am I going to do this? I can do, I can, you know what? I can do this like going in a circle, like a ribbon wrapping around. So I think that's what I'm going to do. But it's look like there's still some white in here that I need to paint. And I know that once I place this on here, if I go in there with the paint, uh, taking the chances that I might paint the pink, the pink uh, clay. So let me see this one. Yeah, it looks like I'm going to have to paint that. Um, this one is still good. I mean, and plus my hand shakes too much, so I don't trust myself. <laughs> so I know I will get paint on that. Uh, but that's okay. Because I have, I don't have big spots there that I need to paint. Just like small little, so this should be quick. Alright, so this is the new paint that I'm using. Uh, Shelby was using this on her project. She said this is what she likes to use. So I'm going to try this out. Because I already had tried uh, two other. And it takes one too many strokes to get that gold. I don't know if it's the paint, um, the product, you know, the name brand, or... The brand, I mean, or if it's just the paint itself because it's gold. So I'm going to, this is, let me see. You know what? I'm actually going to shake this. I want to make sure. All right. Here we go. I'll just reach. the edges make sure there's no white showing now I just have to decide the gear at the bottom turns off the caption the gear at the bottom turns off the caption what gear on what on the laptop itself or for the Mevo Oh, okay. So, maybe if I turn it off on... No, but see? Here's a question for you. If I'm recording, why do I see it on my laptop, but I don't see it here? Maybe because I'm watching it right and that's why when i downloaded i can still see it all right you say at the gear at the bottom uh start mm -hmm. come on where it's not under community standards oh wait there it is i found it uh turn off all right so let's see here okay i'm not seeing on my laptop and then we'll go from there and see if it shows up. Just see what. Um, these molds right here. Yes, I made them out of clay, white clay, and then here's the mold, silicone mold that I use. They came from. I like it. again I think I want to say if it's not Amazon then it's Michaels because I know Michaels sell these um, and then I'm just and get over there so the same way I showed you how I did uh, not this this right here you know just add the clay I but this right here I had to brush it with oil because sometimes you can get away with doing it you know they'll just pop out sometimes depending on the clay uh but because i use i use this one for whatever reason when i was trying to pull it out it just kept getting stuck and kept ripping so i definitely had to make sure that i brushed enough oil on there and it was very easy to remove um I, okay foam or paper clay 
foam or paper clay no uh foam clay i use both foam clay now both foam clay is a, a little bit more drier if that's the right word you know to use um more like not condition um and it's a little bit yeah i guess you can say drier compared to uh see so here this is foam clay right this is both and i love both because uh you don't have to let it sit to dry up compared to this one right here this is really soft clay and this type of clay when it's soft you have to let it sit for a couple of minutes in order for you to start using it for molding now when it's to this right here you don't have to worry about that because obviously it's going to mold itself um and then you have like almost a medium if um clay which is um this pink one so this pink one right here this light pink one is from um glisten glue and then uh the little bit more softer clay it's from um marie's what is it uh creation oh my god what is marie's clay she's <laughs> oh uh great creations uh which is also foam clay and then uh, bowls which is uh well from bow and that's a little bit more drier than the other two so these are again are, are just clay and i just went ahead and just mow that took it out and then i just started painting and because i'm painting it gold I, you know as you can see i have to give it a couple of coats in between to make sure that it's completely painted um but foam sheet um yeah you can use a foam sheet on this one um i don't even know a foam sheet ooh, i have used foam sheets um to when i want to make certain designs to that but then that's a whole different thing you know because that's more like um there's uh certain well they're too far away for me to show you but they are stencils you know that you can trace out and then just go in with the pair of scissors and cut that um which i have a whole bunch of them right underneath here in my basket because i used to before do um use a lot of uh, crafting paper you know uh, cardstock and do a lot of you know stenciling and, and stuff like that so I have quite a bit down here and I was learning how to do uh, birthday cards you know like the pop out cards and um, that's where all of my supplies I actually started working on Michaels <laughs> and I got all of my supplies from there and uh, you know getting the discount you went kind of crazy with that so I, when I started working there, I found it very interesting, and I was like, let me try it out. And then I, uh, I learned about fake baking, and I got bored with that other stuff. <laughs> but yeah, they do have stencils. You just have to trace it and then just cut it out um, with really, really uh, small uh, scissors, like pointy scissors. I have, I, I just, here, like these right here they're really small and they're almost like when you're sewing these really small ones. so i have some others that you know and i love using these when i can't get into certain places on my with my big scissors whenever i'm cutting um and i don't know if you can see but oh you probably can see those scissors sitting right back over there those are um like what do you call those scissors like they have like little designs on them and that's where they all came from because I, I used to be into a lot of, um, just to do a lot of craft, but it had to do with paper and stuff like that, you know, a lot of uh, journals. And I used to love doing, um, what they call it, junk journals. So, yeah. And then I got too much, uh, I did two book, two big books and I was like, you know, I think I'm done. <laughs> And then I saw once again, you know, like I saw my sister doing pay bakes. I'm like, ooh, that looks interesting. I'm like, let me see. Let me give that a try. And yeah. And then from fake baking, I went into doing my characters. And that's what I like doing right now. I have been gotten tired of 
doing those. Yeah. <laughs> so I know that's not what you asked me, but <laughs> I, I don't know why. <laughs> I just thought, you know, to share that with you guys in case some of you did not know that. Yeah. So like the birth, not the birthdays, why do I want to keep saying birthday? The Christmas cards that I sent out this year, I made them all. Um, and I think they were a lot better. Who is your sister? My sister. Who is my sister? Uh, she is not here. My sister is, does she doesn't do lives or she, she doesn't, um, uh, she's too shy. You know, I've asked her many times, like, hey, come on here. Well, no. <laughs> she, uh, reason she doesn't do lives is that she doesn't, um, she doesn't have a filter. I'm just going to say how it is. She does not have a filter. And she said, you know, like, I don't want to go on there and then, you know, not <laughs> be polite if somebody says something to me. <laughs> She's like, so I'll just stay off behind cameras <laughs> right yeah they they mean so much more you know when you're personally doing something than to rather just go to the store and buy one i mean don't get me wrong they're sometimes they're easy because i also do that sometimes like i'm not gonna i'm just gonna go to the store and get a card uh but then there's so much personal when they come from you because you put so much into it you know and then when you tell someone hey i did this you know i made this card for you it's like touches my heart i know when my boys were little and they would do that i would rather have them do that than to go buy a card from the store you know um even to this day i'm like why can't you just grab some crayons and <laughs> make me a birthday card or what? whatever and they're like mom i'm 30 years old why do i look like playing with crayons I'm like what's wrong with that i play with clay so okay so i think this is i think i got all of the white okay but i don't know why i painted this i don't know if i'm going to be able to use that on this because this is too uh too small for it all right but these are are done okay nope let me just okay all right so now let me see I'm now I'm going to have to add glue because this is a little drier. I mean, I can still probably get away with it, but I'm not going to take a chance. And I'm sure most of you know that I don't like to use glue because glue is not my friend. Uh, fingers always getting stuck. I get it everywhere. And, you know, this is obviously the glue that works, but I don't like it because it's, to me, it seems like it's really runny. Um, I think I have on this. Yeah. But when there's no other choice, you have to use it. <laughs> so. I'm, I'm hoping with my sister, I'm hoping that one day she will change her mind. Um, and she'll come in here and, you know, do a video or at least keep me company. She's like, no. Last time she was like, no, I don't want them to hear my voice. I'm like, why? I'm like, <laughs> are you hiding something? <laughs> like, are, are you? I hope she's not watching. <laughs> like, you're not one of those callers, are you? <laughs> you know which ones I'm talking about. <laughs> it's like, no. Okay, so I think this right here um i don't know so yeah should i start it like up here let me bring this in i don't have to worry okay should i start it this way or flip it this way okay my fingers are in the way you know what i think i'm going to start it that way um yeah okay and then where the gaps are at i'm gonna go in there and i think i'm gonna be adding some roses in there yeah so i'm just gonna have to hold this here for a minute 
And then this is going to be here. I'm using a straw, but inside I put a little stick and it's kind of loose. So I'm going to have to glue that down. Uh, but for now, I'm just, I just have it here just to see before I glue it down. Um, and then it's going to go like this. So I'm still trying to figure out what I want to do here. Or if I can't figure out what I'm going to do there, then maybe I'm going to change this right here. Because I think this is probably too dark. And then let's see here. The other one, I think I'm going to, yeah, add this over here. Oh, see, look at that. It's dripping. Ish. Okay. Let's do this. Yeah, anyways. All right. You can stay up. And then this one. If I were to do the same thing, Let's start it. All right. So I'm going to do that there. And then I'm going to have to make more. Um, and then it looks like it's coming up. So I might, this is not going to hold, and I think I might have to go in and use crazy glue. And that's going to be really scary because that's when my fingers get stuck. <laughs> And I want to press too hard because the clay is still soft and I don't want to make big dents in there that it's not going to be able to, to disappear afterwards because they're going to be in there and they're going to be dry. So. Okay. That's making too much noise. All right. So, so far, this is what I have. Um, I really love this mold right here. I love this look. Um, so I'm going to have to make some in the back. Yeah, back here. I don't know why I just shouted there and there. And then, since I have some of these roses, but I think this is not going to work because these are the same color and they're just going to blend in. So I think I'm going to have to ooh, do some gold ones and then do that. Yeah. So topiary tree. And I think this is going to have to change. I think I'm going to have to change this to something else. But anyway, so I just wanted to, uh, oh, it's already been an hour. I wanted to share with you what I've been working on. And I'm definitely going to come back this week i just don't know if i'm going to come back tomorrow or if i'm going to do it on wednesday because i want to finish this with you and um also okay so i have these right here i don't know you know what here i have you ladies here and then y'all can tell me i don't know if raymond is still here so i'm just saying ladies i don't know who else is here i don't know if there's any guys here or not so i'm sorry if there's guys here <laughs> um so i have these other ones um other little modes here now this is a swan that i have here okay and i painted this one white if you guys saw that i made some cookies um i just posted them i didn't share with anyone how i made them i just posted them i used these little swans and i painted them uh oh you're here okay Oh, you play with your Legos? <laughs> okay. Um, so I went ahead and painted like a pearl color. And I don't know. I don't think this will look. What do y'all think? I did like a whole bunch of little different ones. I have, um, I did some that I did the merry-go-round horses. Really? Horses. Which I know this is not going to look good on that one. But I have these for something else. Um, and then I have, uh, oh, you know what? Picture frames. I wonder what picture frame will look like on there. Okay. What if I were to do that and then add like a little heart in there, you know? What do you think? Yay or nay? I kind of like it, but... I don't know if I should do that. I mean, I do want to make uh, roses and 
see what else I have in here. These, I made so many because I have like little ballerinas. I don't, don't think the ballerina is going to look good on that. Um, oh, I can add like the, a crown, which I also did some crowns. I'd have like a king and a queen, little modes, crowns. I want to make it look like romantic looking, obviously, because it's like for Christmas. What if I were to do that? Like, I'll place the picture frame there and then add the, is that the queen's crown? Or is that the king's? No, I think that's the queen's crown. So, I don't know if you guys can see that or not. What do you think? Or I can just, let me see, move my finger out the way. Um, or I can just let it go and <laughs> add the picture frame itself and then just add like small little hearts in there you know and then just add more of the modes over here oh so look at that i'm pressing down too too much too much okay and um yeah so that is what i am working on i thought i had some hearts here but i don't have any hearts i would have to make little hearts um no and my cookie cutters are too far away for me to get up and get it <laughs> all right so i yeah i think i'm gonna do that i'm gonna let me make some here so i can show you guys what i was talking about that it's you have to add um oil to this type of silicone because it's the clay gets stuck to it all right, so I need white clay. What are you building, um, Raymond? <laughs> it reminds me of Cinderella. It reminds you of Cinderella. Yeah, right. Um, it's. I actually, it also reminds me of uh, like the Nutcracker, you know, and I wanted to, uh, I wanted to do something where I can add the ballerina, um, add the little horses, the, what do you call these horses that they're on the carousel and then the swans too, but I, I love this right here. I was like, oh, let me share with you guys what I was doing. I have to get up for this one. So I'm, I don't want to, but I'm going to. All right. So just bear for, with me for a minute. Oh, what? Yeah. Yeah. Did you get that for Christmas, Raymond? Was that one of your gifts? All right, guys, let me just walk back here and grab someone. Raymond, you actually, this is, um, inspired me when I saw what you did for Halloween. All right. Can you tell me who does she almost kind of reminds you of? <laughs> All right. I'm still working on the body, uh, you know, um, but this is um one of my little characters i want to admit it i used um another different type of mode for her and then i try to do like the big bun i haven't seen this since august but the finish one i got for christmas oh okay i haven't seen it since august. <laughs> yeah yes um and I went ahead and, and uh, like I said, you inspired me. When I saw yours, I was like, oh my gosh. But of course, it was for Halloween. So I'm like, I have to make one, just not Halloween. <laughs> so it's just a little small. Um, but still, you know, I'm still working on how to do her her body, her... Because it was supposed to be like a V. <laughs> but it kind of looks... Well, then again, clay does expand. So 
uh, I was able to get some little curls in there, her hair, and then I got little feathers on there. And I gave her a little mo. Now, I'm not good with doing lips, so she does have some big lips on her. Um... <laughs> uh, but yeah, I'm I'm practicing, you know, I'm still learning how to how to do little small characters. So I thought she was cute and I wanted to add her like on top of a cake. So bring the, yes, I did you see the series? Oh my god, I, I fell in love with it. I love all of their costumes. I'm like, oh my gosh. Uh but yeah, so this is who I I I did and then um I want I don't know if I should give her like a cake. I wanted to add her like something like that, you know, where I could get, maybe I'm gonna need a little bit bigger picture frame, but to put her like this. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Christine. Um, so I don't know if, if I, yeah, is she covering her up? So I think maybe, cause I actually wanted her to hold on to it, you know, where she could be, you know, but then I was like, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I'm just rambling now. <laughs> So uh, I'll see what I'll do because I this is another one that I also I wish I could have a ballerina that I could have them holding the frame. I think that would have been cute as well. Um, but we'll we'll see what I what I come up with. So, yeah. And then I was also looking at this. I'm like, oh, my God, so many ideas how to put them all together. <laughs> so that is something that I've been uh, doing I guess that's why I haven't uploading any videos <laughs> or videos. That's usually what I do. Uh, let me bring it back up here. So, uh, yes. Well, thank you guys. Uh, so if you guys want to learn how to make her, I will be showing you, um, I will be making a video how I made her. It's just a lot of patience because, uh, this right here, this part, uh, it is the mold that I have, and I got it from Timu. Now, they are, because they're so small. Here, let me show you. This is the one I use right here. They're so small, you're definitely going to have to use... Oh, great. Let me toss this over there. You're going to definitely have to use uh, oil to put the clay in there and then get it out. Um, but if you've used these before, then I obviously I don't have to tell you this, but it you have not and this is your first time or you have not tried it you know it is fun to do your own projects and you will learn as you go uh, there are times that I just want to just <laughs> throw it in, but I'm like no Maria don't give up <laughs> you're gonna try it so yeah so I just went ahead and used those right there and I went and put it all the way around her dress and I was kind of hoping I could do it like underneath but then I thought that was maybe uh, that would probably be a little bit too much so yeah we'll do that oh thank you um so he soon will be replaced i'm gonna have to get out the way <laughs> she's gonna sit there i'm thinking about making her a little bit bigger but i'm not too sure just yet uh but let me show um how i did this one and what is these are really hard to pull out if they are dry because they will rip on you um and I have tossed them in the freezer. A lot of times that doesn't even work because the clay is still soft underneath. Everything on the top obviously is dry. Uh, but what's underneath is it's not. Oops. So now with this one, I I was not shy with the oil because I it does dry up pretty quick. So you have to be uh, pretty fast. And being that it's really long, why am I making the long one? I need the smaller one. I don't know why I was brushing that one anyway uh so and then plus it's not helping because my fan is blowing and it's drying it up so I just make sure this has enough oil on there and then let me rub this out I think that should be perfect length yep and then that it's messy Thank you, Carly. Thank you. Hola, Jessica. ¿Cómo estás? Okay. So, 
that is there and now I'm gonna try to cut this off with the knife see if this works sometimes it does and sometimes it doesn't <laughs> oh my god I was about to say and sometimes you feel like a nut <laughs> okay yeah see sometimes like I said it does sometimes it doesn't just try to no see oh wait it's working okay just have to keep going back and pressing it down yeah now this is time consuming you really don't have to do this because obviously the clay keeps coming up so ah, uh, that's taking too long. I'm just gonna add a smaller portion in there. Any gracias too? Bien, bien, gracias a Dios. I'm all good. It was a long day. I had to work today, and sometimes people. I I don't know what's wrong with them. I'm like, just it amazes me. When you come across someone who thinks that they're entitled to everything and they can talk to you however they want and then they're surprised when you're like eh, uh, no you're not <laughs> uh, nope wrong girl <laughs> not gonna happen take that back <laughs> okay all right so let's see try to get this in here My hands are really oily now. And then try to peel this off. Okay. Let's see. This is really fighting me. I love this, but this is the only thing I don't like about that. You have to be very careful because otherwise it'll pull in this thing. It's just, I, don't, I know it was not meant to use to be used with, um, well, I don't know. I guess it was meant to be used with, uh, you can use clay. Just have to have patience, I guess, and be gentle with it. All right. See, that took forever. Did I lose the shake? No. Okay. So. The other side, because I did not add it, if you go in there and you try to do it, I don't know. <laughs> I had a... I have used it. Well, I have not used it on this. I have not freeze this one. I know these I do, but when you pop them out, depending, I guess, how long you leave them in there, the top is dry, but the ends are when you pop it out. There are times that I see that it bends so this figure I have not I will try it but uh, like what was it yesterday when I was doing these right here they um, they were getting stuck so and then I had to use uh, baby oil to, to pull them out from you know from them getting stuck and all that so I'm only going to go halfway. Okay, this thing just made a liar out of me. So <laughs> that came out <laughs> fine. But then again, I didn't cover the whole thing. <laughs> okay, so I guess it does it whenever it wants to. <laughs> Let me finish doing that. get a little bit more oh goodness what time it is okay so I am going to um, finish this and then um, wait until they're completely dry and then go in there paint them and then next time when I come live I'll share with you either it depends on how I feel if I want to finish it up because I can't wait on patience and yeah see look at that this is why I don't like glue 
because it's coming up it's not sticking so and then also give it time for my clay to dry uh, and I don't have to worry about any marks in there so topiary but anyways uh, thank you so much to all of those who stopped by to say hi to spend your day with me or your evening I don't know what part of the country you're at or in uh, here it is already six o'clock oh a little past it was it six twelve yeah so just wanted to come in here actually real quick to share with you my cookies and I think they are done well that I can come in here go in there and then just write a little message I think this one let me see this one says uh, be mine and then the other one says love it's 5 12 in Texas so you're an hour behind um, I don't know what is four o'clock of okay so it's the afternoon <laughs> where are you at uh, Ellen oh you're, you're wait you're in Colorado yes Colorado um, duh. I don't know how many times you already told me that <laughs> and I only tell you that my son is in Colorado too <laughs> uh, but yeah, so I guess I'll, I'll, I don't know, I'll figure out what to write on this one. So once I, after I write it and after that ink dries completely, then I'm going to go in and I'm going to spray it down. And that would help it, pre uh, prevent it from cracking. And I'll just seal it up and I'll give it that really glossy look to it. And I'll take a picture so you guys can see, I hope you can see the difference because in person you can tell um between let me see i don't know uh oh this one came off it, and actually you know what it looked like it also shrunk a little bit yeah and i just hit this and it fell off so i'm gonna have to glue this but i don't know if you guys can tell it's the camera i don't know if you can tell the gloss the different this is the glossy one right here and then this one is the one i just made but yeah <laughs> and all right so i'm gonna let this dry up i'm gonna paint these and then hoping hoping that i'm able to come back on here on wednesday if not friday but i do when i am planning to come back over here i want to do more lives uh i know i really don't i just do like what once a week but i want to get in here and try to what the heck is going on with my my cookies are pressing buttons on my laptop <laughs> they're alive <laughs> uh anyway so i want to come in here and uh like i said do more videos you know share with you what i'm on what i'm doing what i'm up to and i want to sh also share with you guys how to make her i really love how she looks i love it. uh i just have to figure out what i want to do if i want to give her that big picture frame i just have to I don't have one, so I would have to place an order and wait for it. Because I, then again, I've been wanting to get a big picture frame um, mode. And then just place it in there like that. Have her hold it. Or I can have her holding uh, a dessert cake. Let them eat cake. <laughs> Anyways, so. Uh, okay. And then also I want to share with you the next time I come around. Uh, what the other that I've been working on what I want to use these little guys for you know on my little ballerinas because I really got inspired with the nutcracker that I went to watch um so I wanted to do something with that anyways and then like of course I also have like a whole bunch of them that I pre-made in here <laughs> all right so I am going to let you go Thank you so very much for stopping by. I really appreciate every single one of you for being here, for taking time out of your day. I hope each and every one of you had a great uh, Christmas. I, again, I want to say Thanksgiving. <laughs> Maybe I need a Thanksgiving do-over. <laughs> um, and uh, if... Yeah. But I don't know what I said. If... Yeah. Oh, oh yes. That's right. Uh... If you guys are not doing nothing the next time I am on here, I would appreciate you guys coming back. Again, thank you so much to all of those who shared me, who spread, uh, sprinkled me out. <laughs> sprinkled me out, not spread me out. <laughs> okay, I need to shut up. <laughs> Anyways, um, 
<laughs> yes. Oh, thank you, Margarita. You too. Thank you. Um, and I hope you guys uh, got some ideas. You know, if you have not done any fake bake cookies, you know, I'm I'm happy if I was able to teach you something. Um, if you do make some of these, uh, Joe, I'm not gonna look at that LO <laughs> L because I'm gonna start laughing. <laughs> um, nope, too late. And uh, don't forget to share with me. I would like to see your creations, especially if I inspired you. You know, because that's why we come in here and we do this. We want to share with you guys our creations, what we do, what we learned, uh, and to share. You know, to talk, to share about anything well whatever big brother <laughs> won't yell at us about <laughs> anyways all right i'm just rambling okay so i'm gonna get out of here uh and i'm gonna shut this up oh i was about to reach over i don't have to do that anymore Good. <laughs> all right so thank you so very much again um and i'll see you until the next time bye <laughs> okay i was about to say it's simply complete always says uh oh barry's about to die okay bye i'm in camera <laughs> Uh...